the sad story of the Skibidi toilet multiverse. In a quiet suburban neighborhood nestled behind a white picket fence lived a man named G-Man. He was an ordinary scientist with an extraordinary curiosity for the unknown. Every day he would tinker in his cluttered science lab, conducting experiments that often left his neighbors scratching their heads. G-Man was known for pushing the boundaries of science, and that fateful day was no exception. As usual, G-Man was engrossed in his experiments when he noticed something peculiar, a door in the corner of his lab that he had never seen before. It bore a sign that read, do not enter, in bold red letters. His curiosity as always got the better of him. He approached the door cautiously, his heart pounding in his chest, and without a second thought, he pushed it open. To his astonishment, G-Man found himself in an alternate universe unlike anything he had ever imagined, the ski Beatty toilet multiverse. This strange realm was inhabited by ski Beatty toilets that possessed human-like qualities. ski Beatty toilets served customers in charming cafes, worked on construction sites, and there were even scientists among the toilets. They lived in harmony with humans, peacefully sharing their world. G-Man couldn't believe his eyes. He watched in awe as the Sibidi toilets and humans laughed together, worked together, and even conducted scientific experiments side by side. For weeks, G-Man marveled at this newfound universe. He observed the ski Beatty toilets' kindness and the unique camaraderie they shared with humans. It was a world of unity and cooperation, a testament to what could be achieved when different beings came together in harmony. But G-Man's presence in this universe was not without consequences. His unexpected arrival had destabilized the delicate balance of the Skibidi Toilet multiverse. Gradually, the universe began to crumble, and rifts formed in the very fabric of reality. The Skibidi Toilets, once gentle and friendly, started to panic as their world disintegrated before their eyes. Buildings crumbled, cafes turned to rubble, and chaos erupted. The once peaceful ski Beatty toilets were now filled with fear and confusion. Desperation took hold and they began smashing everything in sight in a futile attempt to stop the destruction of their universe. G-Man realized the magnitude of his mistake and felt a deep sense of guilt for causing such havoc. He knew he had to find a way to make amends and save the ski Beatty toilet multiverse. With the help of the few ski Beatty toilets that remained unaffected by the chaos, G-Man worked tirelessly to reverse the damage. They devised a plan to stabilize the rifts and repair the crumbling universe. It was a race against time, but with determination and cooperation, they managed to mend the rifts and restore some semblance of order. However, the ski Beatty toilet multiverse was forever changed. The scars of G-Man's unintended interference remained, a constant reminder of the consequences of curiosity unchecked. G-Man returned to his own universe, deeply humbled by the experience. He had learned a valuable lesson about the consequences of his actions and the importance of respecting the boundaries of the unknown. And as he resumed his work in his suburban science lab, he couldn't help but look at that mysterious door in the corner, now sealed shut and wonder about the many other universes that might exist beyond it.